Hello everyone, it's me from My Mellow Days and today on this video, I want to talk about how I did this drawing. I actually remember to film it because normally I always forget and uh, I, I even asked Mono to help me. When I started this drawing, I actually didn't know what I was going to draw. I just drew some leaves and then the flower and then I added the triangle shape and I kind of then just took a break and I was thinking of what I was going to do next because I didn't have an idea. And then the idea came to do something in the Art Nouveau style that I often see on Pinterest that I wanted to try. For this drawing, the materials I used is my Archer and Olive notebook. It's one of the older models, the Golden Flowers. I usually always start with a pencil sketch with a mechanical or a number two pencil, something with a soft lead. So when I erase, I don't have any creases or or any hard lines left behind in the paper. After the pencil sketch, I will use the Pigma Fine Liner for the inking part. For the watercolor, I used a Winsor & Newton Cotsman. It's the Studio Palette. And also I used the watercolor by Coliro for the gold details. I was really inspired by the by the art by Alphonse Mucha. I think that's how you pronounce it. I always thought it was Mucha, but I saw a video on YouTube where his grandson pronounces it Mucha, so I will say that. This drawing actually took me a couple of days to do, to finish. I did the inking in, in one day and then Maybe a couple weeks later, I decided to do the watercolor because I was unsure of the colors. Choosing a color scheme is really difficult for me, so I was on Pinterest looking up color palettes or ideas so I can choose something. And I found something, it was uh, neutral, very soft with gold tones, and, and so that was what I decided to do for this one. And I like how it came out. It's not bright. I didn't want something bold or too flashy. So I'm pretty happy with the results. If anyone else is like me and it's not easy choosing colors, I would suggest maybe to go on Pinterest because there's a lot of ideas and color schemes that are already done so you can just take a look and choose something from there and get ideas. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any suggestions for another video or just any comments feel free to let me know down below. Have a good day and I'll see you for the next one.